Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Now this video is going to be a vlog wherein I'll be showing you guys that how I spend a lazy weekend. It's 12 noon currently and I woke up quite a few hours back. Then I had my breakfast and now I'm sitting down with my book and a tumbler of water. So this is the book that I'm currently reading. This is My Life in Full by Indra Nui. I'm halfway through this book and so far I'm loving it. Now I'm going in for a very warm and relaxing shower and post that I'll also be showing you guys my skincare routine. So these were the products that I used during shower. I used a face wash, a body wash, a razor to shave and also a face scrub. Now coming to my skincare routine, I started off with the niacinamide toner. This is from Glow Recipe and my sister got it from the US. I started off by taking some toner on my hands and then I gently patted it on my face. I use a toner to minimize the visibility of pores on my face. Then I take the niacinamide serum and again I take a small quantity of it and then again gently pat it on my face. I use a niacinamide serum because it reduces the appearance of acne marks and scars on your face and also leaves your face with an even skin tone. Then I take this moisturizer from Simple which is by far my most favorite moisturizer. This moisturizer will help you lock in hydration on your face and also it is fragrance free so it won't irritate your skin. Lastly, I use the Aqualogica sunscreen because it is very important to use SPF in your skincare routine. Sunscreen protects your skin from the harmful UV rays and also prevent premature aging. You should take a generous amount of sunscreen and then blend it on your face. I particularly like this Aqualogica sunscreen because it does not leave a white cast. I also use a lip balm on my lips so that I can lock in the hydration in my lips and my lips feel juicy and plump throughout the day. After doing my skincare and taking a shower, I sat down to do my work and then continued it for a while. I also decided to visit the famous Sarojini Nagar market. As I entered the market, I was greeted with a plethora of shops selling everything from western wear to traditional Indian clothing. One thing that sets this market apart is the affordability of the items. You can find trendy outfits at a fraction of the cost compared to high-end malls in the city. But make sure to bargain to get the best deals. The market is a paradise for fashion lovers with shops displaying the latest trends and designs. I found everything from funky t-shirts to elegant ethnic wear. The quality of the clothes is excellent and you can get your hands on designer inspired pieces without breaking the bank. If you are a foodie, you will be spoiled for choice with a variety of street food stalls in the market. From Golgappas to Chaat, the food here is finger licking delicious. Then after shopping for a while, I returned back home and then my sister came to visit me. We ordered food from outside and we enjoyed it a lot. I feel that there is something about reading a book before bed that is so calming and relaxing. It is the perfect way to wind down after a long day. So yes, this was my calming weekend routine. If you like the video, then don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.